Aloha. You're watching F5 Web Media On Demand. I'm Peter Silva, Technical Marketing Manager with F5. And we're here at the Mandalay Bay Convention Center in Las Vegas for the 2011 Interop Conference. A couple days ago, we announced our new Viprion 2400 chassis. It's a mid-range, chassis-based hardware platform for the big IP. And I have Paul Zabo here. He's one of our senior architects. Thanks for joining us. I just thought we'd get a little insight, some background on the 2400 and what it may mean for you and your organization. So thanks for joining us. All right. So tell us a little bit about this uh, Viprion 2400. So uh, Viprion 2400 is our mid-range chassis platform we just announced. And what it allows you to do is at a, at a much lower uh, entry price point than a Viprion um, high-end chassis that we've had for a number of years. It allows you to uh, pay as you go by putting actual real hardware in there instead of paying for a license. Um, each of these blades here will linearly scale, so when you put the first blade in, you get so much performance, and then when you keep adding blades, it linearly multiplies the performance out. So that's the basic elements of it. And then also available on this is our VCMP technology. And what that allows you to do is split up the chassis into virtual instances of a big IP. And you can see here we have one that's running local traffic manager, another one here that's running um, ASM, our security uh, manager, and another one that's running our global traffic manager. You can also see back here multiple apps running on multiple different physical and virtual machines. And you can also split those up so that different apps are on different instances of these, the versions. They can, you can upgrade the versions independently, so if this app here is a new app and you want to put a fancy new iRule that has a new command that you need, you can upgrade one of these instances without taking down or, or changing the versions of those other instances. Get your new stuff, and then the old stuff here keeps running nice and stable on the norm, older versions of software without interruption. So that's basically uh, the 2400 and VCMP in a nutshell. So it allows uh, a virtualized application delivery controller and multi-tenancy on the same box, right? Correct. Exactly. And so, in a, in a in virtualized situations, you know, one of the one of the challenges would be when hardware gets to a certain limit. Even though there's logical separation, many customers can be affected by it. Correct. Yes. And so, hold on. We got our announcement. We're about ready to open, and I think we're open right now. So. Uh, so it handles, it takes care of that situation as far as the hardware limitations. And then with multi-tenancy, then, uh, da, 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 I know this. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> well, the, the advantages of the multi-tenancy you get are the version independence. That's right, yeah. Um, and upgrade independence, um, failure independence. If somebody uh, if somebody uh, runs across a bug here, uh, you probably shouldn't put that away. Yeah, that's okay. But if there's a issue with this instance right here, it won't affect the other instances because it's virtualized. Um, and um, you know, trying to upgrade software for the for all these for a box that's just running standalone and multi-tenant, you know, already based the same version of software, you're going to have to go through a, a service window for all these guys. Instead, now I've just got a service window for the particular app. I'm and you can uh, run different versions of Big IP on each of the blades, right? right? Mm -hmm. Cool. And we have one over here. I just thought it'd be nice to show our show our viewers. So this is our 2400 chassis. It's uh, for you. And you can see the blades here, and all four of them. Uh, slots for four of them, power supplies, everything nice and accessible in the front there. And then we just grab these things. We tried it earlier. Just you unscrew it. Pull it out. Pull it right out. Put it back in and replace it. I think they're going to go sideways now. And what's nice about this is this could still be running traffic. Yep. It's all hot swapping. Oh, didn't work. Edit, edit, edit. <laughs> uh, it's okay. There we go. There we go. <laughs> we want to like change the speed on that or something. <laughs> Lots so of they... power supplies. Um, this is a hardware is designed to stay up when you have to maintain it. These are pretty cool solid boxes. So if you're in uh, Las Vegas, come on down to the Mandalay Bay Convention Center, visit F5 Networks and booth 2027. Thanks for joining us today, Paul. Great stuff. Thanks for watching.